welcome back to the channel the arch crafter and today i have got something new to share something new to share um something i've never had on my channel before but let's have a look so it is a westminster collection it's a coin that my husband got for me in the post so it comes in this lovely pouch he said he noticed it pop up on facebook and he said i know you're a bit of a fan and not you know it is the Hogwarts coin. Oops, going to focus very well. But I think you can just see the train. It really, really doesn't want to focus, but you can just see the train. You can't make out the letters at all. This camera really, really doesn't want to focus. Let me show you the other side. So it's the Harry Potter. But the other side is just a little bit too detailed for it to focus but let me have a look in this leaflet and I can see if I can see no there isn't a picture of the coin but yeah I love that side of it Quidditch at the top, just there. Let's try the other side. A little bit. I don't know why my camera keeps doing this to me, but it really, really does not want to focus. It wants to focus on everything else, the land and whatever, but just not the coin. really does not want to focus but it is the Harry Potter Hogwarts Express <laughs> yeah but yeah what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put it on display with another coin that I have that I am now going to show you guys so I've told you before I have been a cub scout leader and while i was there when i had just turned fully qualified and we celebrated 100 years not 100 years what am i talking about 30 years of the starting of um cubs it was oh whoops one 
wanted to come out of the case. I don't want you to come out of the case. There's a couple of things trying to get the coin out. So I'm hoping this one will work. So, so let me show you. Oh, 100 years of Cub Scouts. So it started in 1916. And then in 2016 was the 100 years. The reflection of the camera. This is how shiny this coin is. See the reflection. Just see at the here, up here is the scouting fleur de lis, and some trees down here, and then the same this side, and then there is a tent. So, 100 years of Cub Scouts, 1916 to 2016, and then the back. The other side, should I say, is the cups we used to have on the uniform, and then the 100 is coins at the bottom. And my husband wanted to get the scouting coin, and while he was on there, he noticed. The Cubs 100 and then there was the Beavers, I believe that was 30 years, that's where I got the 30 years from, and then obviously the 100 years of um, Lord Baden Powell who started scouting and took a group um, over to Brancy Island and I think it was just a weekend or maybe a week um, just remote just you know be frowned upon now wouldn't it um, <clears throat> just one guy taking a load of kids camping and but that's how he got started that it was the founder Lord Baden Powell and then his sister was it maybe Five or ten years later, created the Girl Guides. Um, I think she more she did the same thing. Um, took some girls. Uh, I'm not too sure how that started or what the the first thing was. Um, but she said, "Why can't girls do it? Why can't?" girls have the same opportunities and chances and um, I think they stood there um, to begin with I think Girl Guides was the homemaker you know the cooking the fixing the mending um, and then they evolved and went on camps and Correct me if I'm wrong, um, like I said, I don't know the Girl Guides side of it, um, but the Scouting and the Cub Scouts. If you have any questions on that, I'll try and answer them as well. Um, but yeah, just one last thing to show you. Um, in the live that I did yesterday, it was asking about volunteer work and things like that and that's when I mentioned scouting and events and skills days and things like that and also the training and the things that we have to do um, it was I think I can't remember if it was whilst I was training or just after I'd qualified we actually did a leaders skills day and you could earn these tokens 
um, the more events and things that you did, the skills that you earned. You earned tokens for fun things to do. So say for example, you cooked something on the campfire. Um, you got given a token to go uh, to go get a chocolate bar or to go you know you earn these tokens to go and get yourself treats chocolate and you know, things like that to go spend in the on-site shop um, but yeah uh, we got um, we got to keep one at the end just as a, a memento and just so yeah we got to keep that from the leaders skills day um, I mentioned that you know we give up our free time and take the kids to do all these events and things like that but there's also the leaders side of it and the social side of it and we do all you know some social events as well and we try and make it fun for us as leaders and um, but yeah as a little memento we got to keep a token from one of the social skills events i think they called it but uh yeah i'm going to display these together these two coins i'm just going to displayed together so I've got the Cubs one down here celebrating 100 years and then I've got the Hogwarts coin there probably everything I've got to show today if I remember or when I can get my husband to find it I shall get the beaver coin and the scouts so there's a scouts memorative coin there's the cub scouts memorative coin and then there's the beaver scout commemorative coin so we got all three like I say, my husband wanted the scouting one, he trekked me and we got the cubs one, and I believe we have the beavers one as well. Sure, we got that one, but I'll get my husband to find them out. Anyway, I shall let you guys go. That is everything to show for now. That new coin, and then obviously showing you what I previously had. Um... So yeah, I'm going to let you guys go. I have got another unboxing to do in a little bit. Um, a gift from the lovely Mike from World of Mike. So I shall stop this recording now, get it edited and uploaded, and then I shall record this next one, this gift from Mike. So enjoy the rest of your day, guys. And remember, in a world where you can be anything, be kind. Bye, guys.